Hello people, hello people. What is going on? Challenger EX coming at you with a very special video. I'm gonna try to keep this short guys, but we did it. We hit 500 subs as an English Toughest Touch channel. Let's give it up people, let's give it up. It doesn't seem like much, but it's a pretty big deal. Pretty big milestone. I'm still trying to shoot for 1K. Uh, I always thought for 1K I would do like a face reveal or like a celebration thing, but we're halfway there. Half a day is pretty awesome. And to celebrate, I do have a couple of things for you guys. I commonly reached out to me to reveal a couple of items that are coming into the game. Like I said, we're trying to keep this short and we're getting right to the point. First off, we have this awesome looking shield here. Ooh, look at that. It's very in tune with the uh, the Forge Lanch update and those uh, Albera enemy mobs we, we got. But this is known as the Brambled Wall. Its description reads, when you're a village chief. Even the heaviest shield doesn't have to be just for protection or for showing off. For example, this one seems to have been designed by a crackler who took one too many rocks to the head as a child. <laughs> Chiseled from a block of bramble stone, it will truly be the jewel of your collection. You guys know me, I always got a kick out of reading these descriptions, but let's go right into the stats. 10 MP parry, five lock, 150 vitality, 10 water resistance, 10 earth resistance and it comes with the stoic shield effect which is of course uh, when you get hit by a critical hit you gain critical hit resistance. My initial thoughts on the shields it's it's a little bit underwhelming to be honest. I don't think anybody's gonna go out of their way to make the shield and replace the shield they have right now. Uh, this shield the bramble wall is very comparable to the stats of the semen shield. Uh, the only difference is if you're looking to get the extra 10 MP parry boost from uh, fighting an Inu or anything that removes MP. That would be the only reason to to use the shield over the saving shield. But other than that, um, it looks pretty cool. <laughs> it looks pretty cool. So that is the Bramble Wall. Next up we have this fancy looking axe known as the Ragnarok Dolia. <laughs> Originally used by carpenters to cut slates for the roofs in the ancient kingdom of Ephedria. Ephedria. I wonder if that's in PC Dofus. I never, never heard of that before. People with a checkered pass now use it to slice the slate clean. <laughs> oh, damn, if you, you got to take down the haters, this this axe is for you. <laughs> um, all right, and here are the stats. This is a very interesting uh, axe. Uh, we, it hits for three elements, uh, uh, 16 to 20 in earth, 16 to 20 in fire, 16 to 20 in air. So for my multi-elemental folks out there, this might be an axe for you, especially if, uh, if you got a power build. Uh, stats, 400 vit, 50-50-50 in strength, intelligence, and agility. Pretty solid there. Uh, 30 wisdom, 25 power, 5 crits. 15 across the board in earth damage, fire damage, and earth damage. Ooh, this is a powerhouse over here. 15 prospecting, 8 dodge, and 10 water resistance. One thing I do have to point out is that these two items are not related. They are not part of a set, even though visually they look like they go together. <laughs> but in Dofus Touch, they're, they're not set items. Just keep that in mind. Right off the bat, folks, this looks like... It's a match made in heaven for Yops. Uh, Yops can be built in uh, earth, fire, and air. There's not many classes that can be built in these three elements. I think it's Yop, Saramp, and and Craw, right? So three classes could take advantage of this. Uh, f I mean, take full advantage of it. I know for Saramps, when they usually go uh, the the Omni built or the the Tri Elemental built, it's, it's mainly due for the trap uh, trap build the. Uh, so I don't know if Ceramps would actually use this, maybe, um, could be an option there. Uh, cross, I'm, I'm, I'm familiar with Cross, whether they want to run an axe. I, I don't know what Cross usually run. Or I don't know if uh, a tribe build on Cross, it's even a thing right now. But I know Yops, Yops love power, love power builds. And this looks like a Yop axe. And from the looks of it, it's gonna hurt pretty hard. So for my... For my folks out there who, who run Yops, you might want to check out this axe. It looks pretty awesome. So there you go, folks. Here's the two items that I'm revealing here in this video. 
Uh, again, my personal opinions are my own. The shield looks cool. Besides that, it's pretty mid. It's pretty eh, whatever. The axe is pretty awesome. It looks awesome, but because of the uh, specific elements it's hitting in, it's very limited to, again, what did I say? Three classes out of the 15. But besides that, I think it's a pretty solid axe, and I think it's going to be a pretty good option for for the yacht. But don't tune off yet. We do. I do have another little surprise for you guys, and it's a little giveaway. And it's going to be a giveaway for the uh, fans of the channel, people who kind of been sticking around for, for a while. And I'll be giving away a YouTube cape to one lucky folk out there. One lucky person. And let's see, what am I going to do for this? So for this, number one, like the video. Number two, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Number three, leave a comment telling me what's your favorite video on the channel. I think that could be fun. Let me know what's your favorite video and use the hashtag ChallengerDofus along with your character name, class, and server. And as always, the winner will be chosen at random through a raffle. And I probably won't be doing a follow-up video. I'll, whoever wins, I'll just leave a comment. I'll reply to your comment uh, that you've won and forward your in-game info to my contact and comma so you get the awesome YouTube cape. Good luck, folks. And until next time, this has been Challenger EX. Hope everybody's doing good. Hope everybody's having an awesome 2023 so far. And until next time, take care of yourself. Peace.